This is the DJI mic. Fortified, fortified, fitting like a motor car. I ain't regular, feel like Jordan wearing 45. Traumatized, victimized, seen some of my dive. Knock you off a base with a bat when them niggas slide. Homicide, genocide, televised, emphasize, perpetuating war. Tell that nigga he gon' pick a side. Hood ties from hood lines, my nigga doing dope lines. Don't run into the cops, that's a big exercise. Uh, don't run into the cops, that's the motto. What's up, guys? Welcome back to another video. Uh, if you look behind me, this is a good setup, isn't it? I, uh, I have a video coming out after this one, maybe after a couple videos. I have a whole time-lapse video about me building my whole desk setup. I'm so excited to upload that video, so that'll be coming out really, really soon. Today's gonna be a review about the DJI mic. I bought it for $350 on Walmart. We're gonna see if this is, like, worth it. The mic is high quality, and if it's nice, and if it's actually worth the money to buy it. So if you're someone that's a content creator, or an interviewer, or anything. So right now the sound quality is coming from the Sony a7 III. Uh, this is the camera that I record with, it's about a $2,000 camera. So here it is. So yeah, it looks as if it is a knockoff set of AirPods, but it looks, it looks sick. I mean, you get, you get two transmitters or receivers I think they're transmitters or one transmitter and two receivers or is it I don't know if it's flipped obviously you have the one that you hook up to uh, this is where you get to see the audio levels and it's where your mics are gonna send the audio to your camera uh, just a normal cord here I'll hook it up from here and then the other part will go you know the other part will go into your camera so there's that. And then you have two mics. Um, I've actually never used this one. I only use one since there's only one person talking. And I always use the left one. I don't know why I'm left-handed or something. That's why. Uh, so yeah, it's really, really nice. So that little bit in there, that is your, the little gray thing, that's the mic. So let's hook up the mic right now and let's give it a good test to see if it's worth it. You guys can be the judge whether or not the audio quality is good. Hey, so here we go. We have the mic set up. A couple things you'll notice is it probably sounds a lot more full and you're actually getting the audio like up close to my mouth. It sounds like a more distance when I'm recording with the built-in quality on the a7 III. Now the a7 III, obviously it is a mirrorless camera and even like big built cameras they don't have good built-in quality when it comes to mics they care a lot more about their video quality which i think is perfectly fine i mean it records flawless 4k 24 and 30 fps videos so we're gonna test it right now i'm gonna test some distance to see how much lag we get if we get any lag from like kind of a farther shot it is freezing cold outside with tons of snow here in Utah, so I am not gonna go outside and record. So I'm just gonna stay in my house and we're gonna like take it far and we'll see how good this mic really is. So let's go and let's go test it out real quick. You guys wanna know something else that's really, really cool with this camera? Is that this camera can actually, there's a thing on the back here and it's a little tiny magnet and you can put it inside your shirt. And then you don't have to hold it. Like it has a clip on it too, just in case if you don't want to use the magnet. But there's a magnet if you don't want to have to hold it. I actually just opened like three boxes before I started recording this video and I got myself two things of um, Shea Moisture Coconut and Hibiscus Curl and Shine Conditioner and Shampoo. It's like the bundle thing and I heard these are really good. So I'm gonna start trying those out. They were pretty expensive, so they better be worth it. I got tea tree oil, you know, so I don't go bald at such a young age and keep healthy hair. And then I got the Shea Moisture uh, leave-in conditioner too. So I don't know why, but Shea has like the best reviews on Amazon. So I'm like, I gotta get me some of their conditioner, leave-in conditioner and their shampoo. And the last thing that I got is I actually got, I got Pete and Pedro sea salt spray, so. Yeah, I've always loved Pete and Pedro. I would love if they got a sponsorship with me because, uh, you know, that'd be great. You know, if I was a hair company, I used to love making hair videos and stuff. Uh, I had a whole Instagram dedicated to like how to make your hair look good and stuff with a pompadour. So yeah, uh, any hair companies hit me up. Uh, I love doing stuff with hair. I was actually thinking of becoming a the barber when I was younger. The sea salt spray was, this thing was 25 bucks. Dang, 
25 bucks for this small thing. Now, if it works really, really good and I only need to use a small amount, then it should last me like months. Like I'm talking like six months. So yeah. All right guys, so I'm gonna test some distant stuff. Um, I'm using the magnet right now that's just attached to my sweatshirt. So we'll see if it actually can uh, notice any of the weird noises of, you know, I'm shaking my sweatshirt right now. So if it notices those sounds, that is one thing to take into account in whether or not you should hold it or if it's okay to put on your sweatshirt. I mean, $350, I better get something that can record my audio really, really well. And I should be able to jump around and it, you know, and it should sound pretty, should sound pretty good. One thing I've noticed with my videos is that I'm actually talking really, really fast. I don't have ADHD or anything like that. I just naturally talk really, really fast when I'm talking about something that I really, really care about. Let's see if I can get this higher up. There we go. Okay, so yeah, I know this was not really, so I know this was not talking about stuttering, guys. For me personally, I love this freaking mic. Like, it's amazing. And I'd prefer, prefer it over any shotgun mic, and these little tiny mics are, we're advancing in our technology so much that these little tiny mics can do just as good as some big shotgun mic. Take that into consideration that we don't need those big shotgun mics anymore. We can go for something tiny like this, even though it's worth three times the price, you know? So ho hope this kind of gave you a decision whether or not, you know, you want to get this mic. So if you were thinking of getting the mic, I'd go for this one. Spend the extra $100 for the two receivers on the DJI mic. Um, so I'd prefer it over. You get so many more features. It links up a lot easier. It's higher quality. It just looks way fancier and it's overall way better. So yeah, it's it's really, really nice. And I love this, I love this mic so much. A couple reasons why I decided to go for the DJI mic over anything else is the build quality. Um, I also trust DJI with my whole heart because I have two drones from them and I loved both of them. The battery life is about 15 hours on one charge for ever, like one of these will last 15 hours, which is a very, very long time. Uh, I heard the mic quality is a lot better too. I heard there's a lot more features, so. Um, new video will be coming out really, really soon. I got two or three that I'm editing right now and I've been spending like, I think 10 plus hours on all of them. Be patient, thank you guys so much for watching the video. See you guys, I hope you guys liked it and it gave you a decision whether or not you should get it. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.